When you've made your curds and you're ready to collect those curds away um, from all of the whey that is left behind, you need something to filter it out. And the traditional way of doing it is to use a cheesecloth or a muslin sheet. And uh, we have one here. This is one of our muslin sheets. And see the size of it. And what happens is you um, you ladle your curds into there, draw up the corners, and then all of the whey comes out. And you can collect your whey uh, and use it for baking or whatever. And um, of course, you then are left with the cheesecloth behind. Now this material has to be good quality cotton. It has to be um, strong enough to withstand disinfecting. I boil mine so that I know that when I put my curds in there, I know there's going to be no infection coming from them. But you have to be careful for another thing because what can happen with this material is that the, the fibres fray out. Now in order to stop that from happening, the cheese and yoghurt making um, cheesecloths are actually over sewn along the edges. So all along the edge you can see that the fibres are locked in position. What happens um, with some inferior ones is that the fibres come out, end up in your cheese and that can create a source of infection. And also as you continue to wash them and wash them and wash them, then unless it's over sewn then they start to fray much more and become pretty useless after a while. So really excellent cheesecloth has to be over sewn at the edges to allow you to use this to your heart's content making cheese.